Today I'm filming a Lush haul. I filmed a video, it was my what I got for Christmas video and I filmed that a few days ago. I'm not too sure when I'm going to put this up because it's boxing day for me so I literally filmed um, the what I got for Christmas video on the same day that I'm filming this. But basically I had to really quickly rush because my SD card earlier on was getting full and I just wanted to get the what I got for Christmas video filmed. But I got quite a few stuff from Lush and I didn't have a chance to go through everything. So in this video, I'm going to be going through every single item that I got from Lush and just telling you what it is. And yeah, so I got a few bits from my parents from Lush because, you know, they know I really like Lush. And then I got some bits from my boyfriend Tom from Lush and this was all packaged up. It was like... um one of those sets that you can buy so they'd bought me a set with them in and it was all like wrapped up and everything and I obviously unpackaged it and everything um but I'm gonna go through what's in the bag first and then I'll go through what's in that box I'll go I'll show you the one that I've used first because last night I did use one in my bath um not a whole one just a little bit of one so the first thing I'm gonna show you is the starlight star bright bath melt and basically apparently it's not really a bubble bar it's like a bath melt so therefore it will change the color of the bath but also will soothe your skin and this is what it looks like so it's like a shimmery star so basically it fits in with this whole theme of silver um but if you actually look at it in the inside it's actually pink focus that yes it's pink in the inside so it does turn your bath a little bit pink which i think is really really cool but you do have to be careful that you don't get this everywhere because as you can see, it's very, very glittery and you can end up making a real mess. So, wouldn't recommend if you want to keep a tidy bathroom. So yeah, that's that one and that's a really nice one to use. It's something I wouldn't usually buy for myself. So I think they're really nice gifts, especially to give me because I just can't justify spending like five pounds on a bubble bar. I just think it's ridiculous, but it's okay if it's a gift. Um, then we have, the candy cane reusable bubble bar so i'll just show this this looks cool this just looks like christmas though doesn't it really um and here it is look at this this is just really cute so i when i have bubble bars tend to just try and get a bubble bar into i try and get a bubble bar into as many pieces as physically possible oh it smells really nice so i'll probably get this into one two probably three or four pieces it depends how the bath goes um because i like to kind of save things but yeah this looks cute so i like this one this is a bubble bar so gives bubbles in the bath and adds color then the next one we've got in here is one i've always wanted to get but again they're so expensive this was like five or six pounds and it's a star on a stick and this one is called the magic wand reusable bubble bar so again this is a bubble bar i'll probably split this into one two three four five probably six or seven because like i said i like to skimp and save um skimp and sa i like to save you know these things and money and whatever mm, actually smells fairly nice sorry this dog is staring at me <laughs> it's just watching me film hello um but yeah this is one i wouldn't usually buy but i just think it looks amazing so yeah i really really like this one i'm gonna put that back in the packaging very carefully people say you can swirl it round with the stick in the bath but i'm not going to do that because the whole thing's going to fall off and it's going to ruin the vibe then we've got the traditional the comforter bubble bar which i've had so many times i actually do buy this for myself it's one that i know i love um it's just a classic and i also think value for money wise is the best one it's the biggest one in terms of you know bubble bars and it's also the best smelling i absolutely love this oh my god i got some on my lip i absolutely love the smell of these and they just look so nice it turns your bath pink it smells really nice makes you feel really cozy in the bath and i always um think that these are great investment because not investment these are always a great buy because you can split it up in so many pieces i can probably split this up into about eight and some people would use probably half so you can just see but it depends what kind of you know how much money you have basically really and when you're a uni student not much so yeah that's a good classic one 
And then finally from my parents, this is the last one. They got me the Yog Nog Yule Log Bubble Bar. And I actually picked out these Lush products, by the way. So you can see that I've selected only bubble bars because I know how, you know, it, it really is about value for money when it comes to um, products like these. If you get in a five, six pound bath bomb and you can only use it once, where's the logic in that? So yeah, this actually looks really, really nice. And I can't wait to use this. I actually got the end piece of this. So this is what it looks like at the end. But when you turn it around, it looks like this. So this, ooh, smells very, very sweet. It actually does smell really sweet. So yeah, this is nice. It's going to be very shiny because I can see it's already got kind of stuff up it. But yeah, it's going to be very creamy. And I'll probably split this. God, I can split this into about eight as well. So I'm predicting what this is probably going to be a soothing one. But you might see me do these, you know, little lush thingies in um vlogs that i do and stuff like that so that's the yule log one which i'm actually really excited to try that i'm um, by the way i'm going to use them up one at a time i'm not just going to mix between them all and mix and match i'm going to use up the starlight star bright one that i showed you at the beginning first and then i'm going to go through them like that just because it's just easier for me to remember it like that so that's what i got from mum and dad in that bag and then i'm going to show dad Hope there's no noise coming from that. No. And then I'm going to show you what Tom got me because obviously he got me some lush stuff as well in that little box. So in this little box, if I open it up, oh, this is what you can see, which I think looks really cute. All you can see is it kind of comes with all these little bits like this, little what are these called i don't know by the way if you saw kind of it dark and it's because my dad just decided to turn the light off it's a good job i've got my studio lights on by the way so that's the reason why you can still see me um so yeah this is what it looks like on the inside just to package it i thought it might be broken because he ordered it in the post but the first thing in there is this snow fairy bubble um shower gel sorry not bubble bath snow fairy shower gel and i know that this is quite famous from the lush store that everybody seems to like it and it's like the favorite thing to buy and it smells a little bit like the comforter actually i think it is the same scent as the comforter bubble bar that i really really like so that's probably oh that's probably why i actually like this and it lathers up really well because i used this in the shower and in the bath yesterday so yeah this is a good one and you know it's only little but probably run out but it, a little goes a long way with that and then I did also get this, but obviously I already had this from mum and dad. So I have two of these now, but they're only little. So that's probably a good thing because they won't be doing this um, after Christmas. So because it's a Christmassy thing. And then this is one I think they always have. This is, um, what is it? The bubble bear thing? What's it called? It's like a bath bear. Hang on. I've got the uh, little guy here, the little list. Oh, butter bear um and i think it this is just a bath bomb so you literally just throw it in your bath and it's a bath bomb um and then we have another bath bomb i don't know if that'll produce any colors or not but anyway this one i'm sure will produce loads of colors this is the luxury lush pub so pu pud luxury lush pud mm. so yeah this is probably going to produce loads of colors so i don't know when to use this one exciting um but yeah so yeah this is that one and it's got like a little kind of holly bit at the top but yeah i expect it to kind of produce loads of colors but i'll probably put that on my snapchat and show it when i put it in so if you want to go and add me on snapchat i'll leave my name on the screen right now and you can go and add me so basically in that little box you get two bath bombs one of them really good one of them a bit more plain you get a shower gel and you also get a bubble bar thingy majig so that's all the products from lush so that's everything to show you that I got in terms of Lush because obviously it would have taken me a long time to show all this in my What I Got For Christmas video and it would have taken up a good 10 minutes so I thought I would do a separate video on its own to show you everything. So if you enjoyed this little Lush haul because I guarantee I won't be doing one of these probably till next year because I don't buy this stuff myself because it's expensive. Um, so yeah, give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and remember to subscribe and I'll see you in my next video. Goodbye. See the little gnome. Mm.